Everett, Washington is best known for being the home of Boeing. But we wanted to check out what else the city had to offer. Our first stop wasn't actually in Everett proper, but a small community called Mukilteo. So it seems the timing of our trip here to the Mukilteo Lighthouse is not quite 100%. It does close in September, so if you do want to go inside the buildings, you'll have to come before then. For today though, we're going to walk around the paths along the uh, shoreline and enjoy the views. Okay, we're definitely going to have to come back here because they have recreational fire pits. You can grab some firewood and just sit by the ocean, pull up a piece of driftwood and have a seat. Something we really liked about the Lighthouse Park was the drive to the park. You're coming down a hill and then all you see in front of you is the ocean and this beautiful point with the lighthouse and then there's a pathway that you can walk along there. Lots of interpretive signs to tell you about the wildlife that uh, live in the ocean. And we saw a seal which was really fun and there is a sign actually about the seals. So we just checked out Haworth Park. Really nice view and we saw a pair of seals. That was kind of cool. And there was some kids looking for crabs. One sounded very excited as he caught a crab. You can access the beach. So you take the path from the little parking lot down the stairs, across the pier. Then you can go down on the beach and apparently you can do crabbing. <laughs> Next stop on our little tour of Everett here is a bakery and we're gonna go check it out. It looks really, really good. We're just gonna go have some tasty treats. With donuts in hand, we found a nice little park to have an in-car picnic. Going to the Despy Delight Bakery really reminded me of the bakery in Hope, the Rolling Pin Bakery, because they had just case upon case of all these tasty goodies for us to try. So we ended up getting some savories, of course. So we got, is this a spinach and feta danish? A chicken empanada. And then we got a little heavy on the desserts. We got this waffle cone donut. That's the one I wanted. <laughs> we got a pumpkin spice donut, a blueberry fritter, and these delectable looking things, which were croissant donuts. Part croissant, part donut. I wanted those ones too. <laughs> and then I really wanted a cookie. And so I asked them what their softest cookie was. She said it's this Reese cookie. It's like so soft, it's like almost falling apart in my hand. It looks so delicious. Let's dig in. Wow, that is a hefty donut. Next, we went downtown. They had their Christmas decorations up and it had a nice small town feel to it. And Everett is the home of Funko, the toy giant most famous for popularizing the bobblehead. The displays in this store were absolutely amazing. Each room is like a whole like little world dedicated to like the types of bobbleheads and toys they have in each area. It's really cute. actual sidewalk in a store. It's so weird. Maybe this was outside at one time. There's just a little skeleton in here. <laughs> I just can't get over the detail of this. You can even create your own custom bobblehead. It's me at the bakery more or less. Look at that little boat! That's hilarious! Found a nice little spot down at the Everett waterfront and we're gonna have our dessert part de. More donuts! There it is! Piece of art. I don't know where I'm gonna bite from. I don't know either, but have a go. Bit the cookie dough. <laughs> <laughs> Going for the good part. Mm. There's a huge barge going by now. We happened upon a big machine that looked like it was going to lift a boat out of water. So of course we had to check that out. To get the boat out of the water, they brought the lift to the ramp and then they put the, the support straps. They lowered those down, the boat pulled forward and then the lift pulled up the straps again with the boat with it. So cool. And then they could just drive on forward. 
There you go, now you've seen a boat fly. Didn't really take them that long to get the boat out of the water. The things you see when you just like show up to random places. It was all done with like this remote control that the guy wore around his neck. It was all pretty cool. We're now at the Evergreen Arboretum and Gardens. We took a nice relaxing walk through the park. Got to California early. Just kidding. So these are carnivorous plants and the fly or the insect or whatever goes in and then the leaf closes on the top and it can't get out and then it digests the insect. And in the evening they had it all lit up with Christmas lights. Thanks for coming along on our little tour of the city of Everett. As you saw, it's a lot more than just Boeing's headquarters. And for now, we are at, what's the name of this park? It appears to be something loud outside. Hopefully you can still hear me. We've got a whole bunch of those. I wanted those ones too. <laughs> and then... Make sure you don't miss the next video by liking, subscribing, and turning on notifications. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you in the next one.